As the school year comes to an end, one Hamilton County school is reflecting on a big donation that brought, brought life back to one popular program. News Channel 9's Greg Funderburg has the story. For these students, art means a lot of different things. What I love about art is making stuff with my friends. We get to paint. Sometimes if I see a painting that looks familiar, I'm like, oh, I, I actually did that in the art. It's these moments that have students pumped about art class at Calvin Donaldson Environmental Science Academy. It's the first time in years these inner city kids have had access. So about six years ago, the money ran out. Principal Robertson says after art was cut, they saw an increase and behavior problems and kids having low self-esteem. But that all changed this school year when Chattanooga native Usher came to town. We um, received funding for the art program and an art teacher for three years. The new art teacher, Stephanie Kroll, is known as Miss Stephanie to students. She says art classes like this are getting cut nationwide but could come back with some help. I hope that more people that have the resources to help out in their communities do because art can change a community. She says arts really help students with time management, good work ethic, and encourages students to support each other. Okay. It is her goal these students will remember positive memories from this experience. They can always go to the art that they like best, whether it be singing or visual arts or dancing or any ways to express themselves is an outlet. Just like this student, Courtney McCoy, showing his dance moves, it's funding that administrators say is changing lives one art project at a time. In Chattanooga, Greg Funderburg, News Channel 9. Usher worked with State Farm to establish the Nancy Lackey Community Education Fund. It is named in honor of his beloved nanny. The goal is to revive music and arts education all across the region. Find out how you can be a part of this amazing program at our website, newschannel9.com. We have posted information. Just click on this story.